Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play Double Dragon Neon for the PS3. I'm Samurai TX, and I'm Sword Snake. And when we last left off, we broke out of the um, lab container that we was in, and uh, we escaped the laboratory, and now we're in some lab again, but ready to do some genetic research. That's what the mission name is. So, um, without further ado, we're going to do research of our own by kicking butt, and um, let's escape this lab, because, um, well... Gotta get out of here, because I have a feeling Skullbageddon isn't even in this bloody lab, so... Snake, you're gonna take over this episode, and I'm just gonna do the commentary. Do you look at that? Looks like we're on some sort of, um... Platform that would, um... It's like Streets of Rage-esque, actually, with the platforming. Um, platform, and it's going up or down. Looks like we're going up, so yeah. Looks like we've got a fight on our hands. We're gonna be ambushed. Oh, look, extra life. I definitely want that. Thank you very much. And, um, Snake's just gonna be beating the hell out of everybody. Or just get kicked in the face by a woman. Not that that's a bad thing. And Kablamo! Goodbye. Dead, dead. And thanks for the mixtape. Stunner! Stone Cold Stunner! Stunner! Yeah, I think that's what they mean. Not really, but... It's way over there. Oh, look, it's Roxy. Right. Well, I definitely um, get the best out of beating Roxy, because, well... No, we don't want Roxy to get the best of us, because, um, she's in the air with the, um, Rocky. I think the, um, the other um, crates is an explosive one, obviously the one on there. And the other ones are um, like health and um, health again. I think one of the healths are actually um, regular drinks, and then the other one then just heals your um, health completely, like heal your health and uh, meter. So what the one I just picked up is just regular health. I think the um, white one is actually um, you know um, actual health and. Um, like refill my meter. So yeah, I guess you don't know that if you've played it already. I guess all of you have already played it if you're Double Dragon fans. I still have a gripe with this game. I, I can't believe it has no co-op, you know, um, online co-op. Could you imagine if this game had online co-op? It probably would have got much better reviews than what it did. But um, for what the game is, I'm really enjoying it. Because like I said in my previous video, um, the Double Dragon game that was released a year before this one, the Xbox 360, was trash. It was terrible. It's not really, it wasn't really a Double Dragon game, like, um, there's lots of things wrong with the previous game, like, um, stamina meter and all that. When does Double Dragon need a stamina meter? It's just, it's just stupid. Like, um, why would you, um, fix a game that's not broken, you know? The, the Double Dragon format is not broken as it is, unfortunately for, um, us. Well, the makers, I don't know who made the game, but yeah, they broke the game. And just made it for the worse, which is pretty, um, frustrating. At least we're still alive here, I'm surprised we haven't died. And I think we just roast that bottle, which we did, and I'm pretty sure... Oh yeah, we definitely roast the bottle on that. Because Bimmy and Jammy! I think that's the name. Bimmy and Jammy is coming after us, and we definitely need that bottle just to distract them. But we do have a baseball bat, and I guess we're going to um, use our natural um, fists to beat Bimmy and Jammy. Silly names, really, but I suppose that was intentional that they did the silly names. Oh look, thanks for the $300. You know, any money's good money for me. It looks like we're getting hurt by both of them, so we need to take care of one of them first. But I think um, Jammy uh, is it Jammy, the red one? Yeah, Jammy's the red one. Bimmy is obviously the um, well, us, but the blue. Right. Let's grab the tape. Thank you. Is there the baseball bat over there? There. Let's pick up the baseball bat quickly. There we go. And now we can um, wait for the platform. Come on. Nice job, by the way, Snake. Thank you. Right. Let's get going. And I think we get to keep the bat, which is good news, that's why we picked it up, you know? Otherwise we wouldn't be able to... There we go, so yeah, we kept it. Can we break that um, barrier? I don't think we can break those barriers. Oh, hello! Um, well, that was disappointing. Oh, that thing gives us um, health and stuff. We really... I really should... Um, if I didn't have this thing in my head, I probably would have punched it more. You're not shooting me, dude. You can take a baseball bat to the face, and um, you can take uh, punches in your back. Thanks, we've got lightning. And another extra life, so that's pretty sweet, actually. Well, four lives, it's pretty crazy, actually. I can't believe we're already on four lives. Let's whack the machine. Let's whack you. He has a gun. Yeah, I knew he has a gun. Yeah, the scientists are starting to pick up guns now. Pretty ridiculous for a Double Dragon game that um, guns are allowed in this game. we got Absorb, which is okay. You're not hit me. And what else have we got? Successful strikes. Yeah, we've only really used balanced and... Um, Balanced and, um... What is it? Spin Kick? I think those are my real favourite ones when I played it previously, you know. Uh, 
my previous trial of this game. Anyway, I didn't beat it, but that's the ones I was literally using because the spin kick just feels awesome. And good thing they kicked me because then the bottle just decided to, um, you know, um, explode on them and um, I didn't really have to do anything. But now I really need help. Look at my health, it's really in bad shape. Let me throw that gun and pick up this baseball bat because your gun is pretty bad in this game. Whack you, whack you. Double hit, double home run. Right, he's done. They're done. What's that? Oh, let me pick that up quickly. Quick, 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 quick. Snake, pick it up, man. What are you standing there for? No oh, weapons up. I guess that's why. Right. Attack to Mikey. Do we want the battery? Yes, we do. There we go. We got no health. We better, we better um, quickly get um, health, you know, because um, we don't get health. We're as good as dead. Oh, thank you very much. Phew, you see what I mean, Snake? The game's on our side in this um, episode so far. I don't think there's any sort of shop around here. I don't think so. Let's um, smack Roxy with a baseball bat and kick her. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, no, mind. we're just going to keep kicking her. I thought Snake was going to use the baseball bat. That's why I got a bit overexcited. And there goes the money. Oh, look, there is something down there. Let's tell us that there's a secret down there. Oh, whoops. Snake, there's a secret down there. The arrow's telling you that there's a secret. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean that. Let me go down. What's down here, anyway? I want to upgrade and get extra lives and whatnot. What's in this shop? Huh. Welcome. Let me talk to the guy, shall I? No, just buy things. Oh, I'm just going to buy some extra lives. I guess that's a good thing. <laughs> I'll buy healing touch. Go ahead, I don't really mind. You can waste money on anything. This this is um, just going to help us. Uh, thing. Unfortunately for us, it's not really the items we want because we're not really going to use them. But we just add them into our library because, well, you know, might as well. But for now, yeah, it's saving our content. Whenever we purchase um, um, techniques in this game, um, it does save. And um, you can't really get a refund or none of that. Alright, that's pretty basic, Snake. Just walk. I got this, don't worry. <laughs> anyway, looks like we're going to have some enemies ready to attack us, so prepare yourself. That looks a robot scientist. Is it me or did the room just get darker? No, it got a bit darker, actually. You're correct. Uh, that scientist is going to get hurt. No, he didn't. Stop getting carried away. See, look, he took your bat. But I got it back. <laughs> okay, no, I lost it. The bat is officially gone. Right, throw her over there, and it looks like they're in trouble. So when they keep getting up, they're going to get squashed. That is pretty painful. I'm surprised they don't die instantly. This is pretty weird that there ain't no instant death from that type of thing. It took a lot of your health. You're like, when you played this game in Double Dragon 2, I think those things actually took a lot of your health. Bang! <laughs> Double kill. Right, he's dead. He's just about dead, to be honest with you. Now she's going to die because she's stunned. There we go. Finish her! Fatality! <laughs> My god, that was awesome! Just killing her like that! <laughs> yeah, you don't feel no guilt towards her, do you? Nope. She's on the wrong side of the battle anyway. She's not fighting for good, she's fighting for evil. And, well, looks like we're gonna have to defend ourselves because this is the boss fight! Fawny Triple Threat, Marion version 2. Wait, you called the plot Marion Skormageddon? Really? Jesus, man. Why are you naming the plant after my bloody girlfriend? What, are you dating the plant or something? Jeez, no, I, I'm not judging your taste, Skormageddon. I mean, look at that plant. Oh, jeez, it's spitting out um, whatever it is. Jeez. The girlfriend's got unique taste, I guess. Unique taste. I'm not judging you. She has unique taste, but I'm just going to beat her up real good. And uh, reveal um, whatever's in this um, root. Let's get to the root of the problem, like Chris Redfield. Yes, I had to throw that terrible pun in here because we're fighting a plot, you know. So yes, we've got to get to the root of the problem. Problem, not problem. What's problem? I don't know what a problem is. My God, stop spinning your rings at me, Marion. I'm not going on a date with you. Wait, you mean you actually consider dating this plot? No. Oh my god, you, oh god, you are one ugly thing. Are you supposed to be a dinosaur? I'm a fire in my laser. Oh god, that dinosaur's got other fire in my laser. Snake, why are you going into the bloody laser? I don't know. 
Oh look, drinks. Sweet. Looks like it's dro it dropped. battery. Get the battery, Snake. Get the battery. Look, the battery's there. Quick, 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 quick. My god, if they let me get the battery first, come on. Oh, I just about got the damn battery. Well, at least you got it. Now I gotta kick it. Oh my god. I gotta kick this thing's ass. I'm gonna destroy that skeleton fairy. Or whatever, it's a dinosaur head. How does a dinosaur head end up in a planet? Video game logic, Snake. Video games. Uh, I think you make a valid point. It looks like you need to get some health. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Alright, so, yeah. This ain't my best performance in this boss fight, but as long as I don't die, I suppose it can be considered a very good performance, because, well, you don't want to die during a boss fight. I know I've died once during Skullmageddon, but that was because, well, um, obviously, I didn't know what to expect, but... Um, yeah, it's time to have some fun with this boss. Let's not get our ass kicked by the boss. Okie dokie. Right, let's just let's just focus on destroying this dinosaur head thing. There we go, it's destroyed, so you only gotta destroy that side. God. She's full of surprises, isn't she? Yeah, pretty much. Just like we all are, sometimes anyway. Well let's see what this one has revealed. I bet it's gonna be some kind of fish. Like a like a porky. Pokemon, Pokemon, the fish, bloody samurai, what are you talking about? Um, I like a, um, bloody, um, piranha plant. No, it's a shark. My god. It even made a plant. Let's go get it, you're screwed up, man. Why are you making the shark in the plant? That's weird. Oh, we are in some kind of lab, and Skull Mageddon is kind of screwed up. He did name the plant Mario, for Christ's sake. That alone makes him psychotic. He's named the plant after our bloody girlfriend. Oh my god, look at his eyes! What that his eyes are missiles! Okay, you know we know we have to stay away from them now. Alright, there we go. Got battery and some health. That drink got us both health and that meter thing. Hey, it's stunned. I couldn't get it. Anyway, oh my god, I missed. And again. Ah relax, you can just use your fist. The Shark is eating me. Stop it. God damn it. Leave me alone. Right. Looks like I'm gonna have some fun with this bird. Now you sound like Wolf, but the only difference is he, you don't say. You, um, you don't sound like him. Well, you did sound like him quotation wise, but um, not like your voice. You didn't like to sound like we're gonna have fun with this thing. Maybe I should voice Wolf O'Donnell in the next Star Wars. Get Star Wars? In the next Star Fox game. Sorry, guys. I'm getting a bit too excited because I'm playing. Because I'm commentating this and talking to Snake and uh, <laughs> trying to um, like um, ramble about anything, really. I, ha I am one to ramble about anything. Anyway, kill this shark, Snake. Nice job. Hey, look at that thing. He's got a mouth. What is that? I'm going to punch it. Hey, there's some metal things coming out of it. What are these things? Um, you actually level up your technique after that, but that's a good job, Snake. We didn't die. So that's time to play the guitar! Yeah! Rock on, dude! Uh-oh. Looks like our life gets even worse as we fall down. And now, level 9, or mission 9 is... Let's see... It's Haunted Forest! So this is the penultimate level, obviously. So this is where we're going to have to end the video because, well, we've um, been going on for 13 minutes, going on 14 now. So when we come back, folks, we'll do the Haunted Forest in the next um, video. So um, you don't want to miss that. So um, until then, until then. Thank you guys for watching, and we shall see you guys in the next video. Samurai TX and Solid Snake signing out. Goodbye. Take care, everybody.